Oh, we're live. I put I put Camille on Tinder, okay, and I like set it all up on my phone. Yeah. And every time I would show her a picture, she'd be like, ew, no. And I would like, even myself, I would try to like start talking to these guys. And then like it's give them her phone number. And she, she just like, would flat out your number. And, and it would be like, I'm like, he's Wait, so cute. No, but the one that you gave the number, I like, she like, I just, I like looked at it and I was like, ew. I was like, did you even look at the picture? She she likes she, like, she likes no. Hispanics. Okay. Because she's Mexican. Oh, you're recording. Yes, we are. I'm, it is so true. No. She's like no. she likes like dark, dark eyes. eyes. Dark eyes. I mean, I mean not dark eyes, but still. dark hair for sure. I don't like. I don't want to date someone who looks like me. But it. <laughs> like, like I don't like curly hair. Like, I don't like like couples. I don't know that like look like brother and sister really creep me out. Yeah, like you want it different. Mm -hmm. That's like why she likes, you know, <laughs> Mexicans. Because she's so Hispanic. Yeah. Stop. Right. Right. She got that joke from my mom. No, I did not. Like, I didn't remember your mom telling that joke. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, Anyways, talk about me. So, okay, uh, Margie, did you end up doing your run? I didn't. No. Okay. So you I did, did the extra day off. I did. Good. Yeah. You needed it. I did. Okay, yeah. It doesn't feel good. You don't want to get my sickness. I seriously, so the kids went to Monster Truck Saturday, and I was like, okay, I had all these plans. I sat on the couch. I slept for like four and a half hours. They came home, and I was like, you guys, I don't feel good. We sat Did on the you couch. Feel like you're sick? Yeah. Like, my lymph nodes were all swollen. They put themselves to bed, which never happened, oh. so I was like, this is like a huge, like, milestone yeah. here. Did Pepper and put him to bed? Pepper and Dakota, <laughs> yeah. It's like, just take care. No, Wyatt, he... He took a flashlight and him and Harper laid under the covers oh. and he read to her and uh, I went to bed at like 8.30 and then I slept till like 8.30 the next day so I got like 12 hours of sleep. You felt fine. And I felt good now. Yeah. You could have just been like exhausted. Yeah. How were you like soreness wise? I was super sore and I was super sore Saturday so I was like am I getting sick? Yeah. You couldn't tell. I didn't know if I was like right. body aching right. or if I was like am I sore from you kicking my butt. You feel fine now. I feel good. Yeah. Well said. Wow. <laughs> Look at all those pins. Everything's color coordinated. What? What does each color mean? <laughs> we don't even have. I know. We don't even have time to go through this. Okay. Um. So, but nutrition wise, how was it? It was good. I mean, okay. Saturday. Yesterday was good. Saturday I didn't good. feel good, so it was like, eh. Yeah. You know, I mean. That's okay. But so today, I feel. I don't. Like I don't. Even like with nutrition, same thing with training. Like, your nutrition. Obviously, I don't want you to go off the deep end, but like yeah. nutrition doesn't have to be like on point, like super rigid every single day. Yeah, it's nice to kind of have a day where it's like a little bit more relaxed. Sure. I mean, today for I, I feel like today I had more than I would normally eat, but I still feel like it was healthy. Um, I had the two egg whites and two eggs and one piece of Ezekiel bread for breakfast. I did an RX bar for snack, and then for lunch I had like a handful. of kale with a can of tuna, half of avocado, half of avocado okay. and then a slice of the Ezekiel bread, nice. and then a little like side of That's roasted good. veggies. But it yeah. felt like it was like usually like my lunches aren't that right, and much. it was good to eat. Yeah, it was, it was like easy. Uh, yeah, good. Yeah, I was like, oh okay, I'm, you know, and I yeah. knew that I was working out, but I know. That's good. That's but it's like getting out of your mind, being like, is this too much? Even yeah. though it's no, you know what I mean. It's not too much, right? I mean, I'm I'm even gonna want your guys' meals to be like even more. But when you start to work out, I like you just have to listen to your body because you're just gonna, you're gonna be hungrier more often, right? And you have to feed it. Yeah. So and you, I don't want you to be like, oh my gosh, like I can't I can't eat that much because you know. Yeah. So. Um. Anyways, all right. So we're gonna do uh, lower body today. Great. I want to do hamstrings and we're gonna do a lot of booty stuff. Awesome. Get up. Yeah. No, we're not your back. So go ahead and give me 10. And we're going to work for us. Uh, okay, stop. You see, look at your setup. Watch your feet under. I want you to set your butt back a bit more. And go ahead and lift your butt. Okay. Keep this. Okay, stand up. Okay. Okay, there you go. Engage. You feel that? Yeah. Okay, I want this to be contracted. Okay. Hold that exactly like it is. Go down and grab your barbell. Keep it engaged. Nice. Yes. So much. 
much better. Everybody always likes to work booty, but we're gonna, um, we're gonna make it work today. Hopefully not too sore tomorrow, because they also have class tomorrow that they'll be doing. And, but I'm really proud of them so far. They both seem dedicated. And, um, you know, I think that's like the first, whenever you have like a client, nobody can actually make them come. It has to be, it has to be your decision. If you want to change your life, you have to say, I'm ready to change my life. Nobody else, it doesn't matter what type of pressure you get, it doesn't matter, you know, your mom, your uncle, your aunt, your best friend, you know, your spouse telling you, like, let's go to the gym. It has to be a decision that you make whenever you're ready to go to the gym and transform your life. Bring your knees forward and use the power of those legs. Down low, yeah? Just like a football player. Yeah. Drive down these cars. Come on, Cam. Oh, she's lost. Good. All the way to the end. Let's go, G. Nice. Good. Clear that bar. Feel? My legs are jello. Good. And you? <laughs> Feel good? 